These are some of the oldest multicellular animals to be found. Here was a garden of strange animals. Now, the most common one is this little uh, pancake-shaped thing. Like a puffed-up placemat, Dickinsonia could reach about three feet across. It seems to have slid slowly over the seafloor, stopping from place to place to feast on the carpet of bacterial slime. So no mouth? No mouth. What is certain is that there were things moving about on the seafloor, looking for food. Sprigina was an animal on the prowl, a pioneer crawling into the record books right here on a long-lost Australian shoreline. <laughs> 